Hey there! Welcome back to the Attorney That Rides Coast to Coast video series. As the evening sky turns to dusk, in just 24 hours earlier, I was gearing up in Jacksonville, Florida to tackle a monster of a ride to San Diego, California. This ain't just any trip. It's a 50 hours or less test of grit across the backbone of America, following the tough as nail rules of the Iron Butt Association. Hey, riding shotgun with me is Deadpool a young blood newbie on the long haul rider's circuit. I'm showing him the ropes, backed by my 45 years of experience riding these roads. We're blasting through the states with a special detour in Kerrville, Texas to catch a full blown 100% solar eclipse. Hang tight as we roll out the miles, sharing the real dealio about the life on the road and turning Deadpool into a true blue iron butt long distance rider. Come along for the ride. It's going to be one hell of a journey. Let's go. Here is my partner over here, riding partner, who when I woke up, I should have taken a picture, but I felt bad for him because he had about 10 tissues stuck up his nose because <coughs> he had a like a sinus infection or something in the middle of the night. It wouldn't stop. And he had a big pile of <laughs> tissue paper next to him. Good. For a minute there, I thought he was squeezing one out. Didn't look good. Didn't look good at all. I'm like, oh shit, what did I sign up for with this guy? Well, Deadpool went to go get his his bike. Getting things ready here. Had to use this damn wheelchair. All the bougie boomers. We're hoarding all the carts. So tell me, man, what happened yesterday that you broke down? Oh my god, the, uh, the negative wire to the battery disconnected, which on the way back to Daytona last year in Savannah, again, the positive battery disconnected from the battery. So, I don't know what it is about Savannah. Savannah hates me. I hate Savannah. But uh, if you go back here... I see the problem right now. <laughs> it's a Honda. Go, go, go. We asked the police officer down there if we could park. I told him what I was doing, the run that I was doing. And he's like, oh, this is cool. Gave him a sticker. My attorney kicks your attorney's ass. So here we go. You ready? Let's do it. Here we are at the beach. I'm with Deadpool. Here's the beach access. Yeah. I was just waiting to turn this guy. So just to give you a recap, 50 hours or less. Deadpool, we gonna make it in 50 hours. Where's Deadpool? There he is. Are we gonna make it in 50 hours? I think so. Yeah? Yeah. We're so everybody's make. gonna be looking at us. Look at those aliens, helmets, extraterrestrials on the beach. Carrying 360 camera sticks and GoPros. That's it. Walking down the water. A bunch of maniacs in biker gear. <laughs> oh, Did you leave us some water? It's a beautiful day on the beach, my friend. Yeah. We won't be there long. Couple so the goal is to put our feet in the Atlantic Ocean. I just hope I don't get all this sand in my boots. 2,500 miles. Sand in your boots. We're here. Look at this. It's beautiful out here. Look at all these bougie boomers. Fishing. If you don't have a motorcycle, you need to go buy one. Right? Go out there and enjoy yourself. We're about to put our feet. I will say the last time I did this, it was very foamy. Not too much foam here today. Looking good. Looking promising. Beginning of an epic journey. That's it, man. Woo! Let's see if we're this excited with energy when we get to California. We'll be beat.
beginning of a great adventure. Now the last adventures I went with the two other folks I lost my friendship with. And one of them I rebuilt. The other guy's just, he doesn't want to re repair the breach. So I offered him an olive branch and he didn't want to do it. So hopefully our friendship will stay intact. <laughs> Brother's blind. You get tired. I'm, I'm going to crack the whip. Crack the whip on me too. You see me slacking. Can't be slacking. Ready. Ready for the adventure. So now we're going to go to the gas station that the Ironbud Association says you have to do it and start it at. I haven't even had breakfast. I'm just going to throw one of those little pastries down my throat with some Gatorade. Get my gas receipt and then the, the clock will start ticking. Woo, I'm getting tired already and ain't even get to the gas station. Somebody fell asleep over there. One last look at the, uh, this is the Atlantic coast. Now we're going to the Pacific coast. Go, 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 gas station stop number five we are in mississippi next stop louisiana bike's doing very well starting to get a creak in my pair my shoulder big old knots hurting i'm just getting old that's what's going on but i will say this that loud ass pipe is killing my ears when i do the hokey hey i might consider get me a softer pipe or get myself some earplugs. A lot of people wear earplugs in their helmets when they do those things, you know? But this helmet I got, the LS2, very, very loud. It doesn't protect against the noise at all. And that, that muffler just reverberates inside the helmet. It doesn't sound as bad when it's all shut with the shield and all that, but it is what it is. Anyways, my boy over here, he's got just bought some Allegri's water coming out of his nose. He's just, my bladder, I didn't clean it out. His, his uh, hydration system he says it was dirty. Tried cleaning it out with super hot water. I'm like, you gotta put some bleach in that water. Kill the good stuff. But anyways, let's see what he's got to say. So I hear you got the flu. Uh, something, I don't think it's the flu. I just, it's so cold. I'm just bummed something out. Something crawl up your nose this last wind, night and die? This wind is just... The wind or your hydration system? It's destroying my mustache, bro. It's a bad look. Look at us. What, what is the guy supposed to do, man? When it's... Crazy glue. <laughs> Crazy glue. <laughs> so stop number five. This is your first time you're doing like an extreme... Oh, this is an extreme run. How do you yeah, feel so far? Uh, longest I've done is Long Island. 
from from Fort Mill, South Carolina. So 13 hours. Not stop. We're coming up to yeah. So we're coming up to that. It's almost. You know, I think Kersville will be that. 1,200 miles. About the same. So uh, yeah, all oh, having a blast. It's fantastic. I love it. I can't wait to turn around and come back. <laughs> all right, Mr. Navy. It's looking good, man. It's looking good. So what ship did you serve on? The Stennis, USS John C. Stennis, CBS 74 aircraft carrier. You say that so fast as if you know it by heart. Filming? No, it's not it's filming. Frozen. Filming is from the 1970s. Jesus this Christ. is recording. Yeah, recording. These millennials. Oh my God. Ah, oh, that was more than 81, bro. You still gonna drink water out of there, man? You don't know if there's rat shit in that thing. And giving you the giving powering. you. Powery. Yeah, that power, yeah. You need to throw some vodka to, to oh, sterilize shit, it in there. I don't need none of that. Well, we're going to hit the road, man. Enough of this farting around. Oh. We got to keep those wheels turning. Oh.